welcome back to my channel so today's video is gonna be a get ready with me slash tutorial kind of like a mixture of both on the look i'm wearing right now this is actually my because beauty day 2 look and you guys all seem to love this makeup i have received hundreds of requests to do this makeup and of course I quickly did it because I really want you guys to, you know, be able to try it out for yourself. It's got the wing liner, but I mean, very subtle lang siya. And then the ombre lip, the full freckles, and the dewy, glittery skin. I'd say this is a daytime glam look, but still very wearable, very cute. And kahit anong damit ang isuot mo sa kanya babagay siya, especially for like vintage dainty outfits. This is such a cute look. By the way, halos lahat ng mga products na ginamit ko for this tutorial, um, affordable siya guys. Nung ginawa ko kasi yung makeup ko nung araw ng Because Beauty, yung ibang gamit ko high-end siya. But for this, I wanted to do a more affordable version. Version. So I tried to keep everything as affordable as possible. Yung mga iba, wala akong products na perform the same way. So pasensya na like my highlighter. Everything else actually I feel like is affordable. And mahanap mo siya here sa Philippines. And ilink ko naman sa description box as always. Check na lang kayo. May links na ako ilalagay para pag-click nyo, nandun na kayo sa product. And pwede na siyang bilhin. Uh, mula ng hassle for you guys. But before anything else, kung hindi ka pa nakasubscribe sa channel ko, of course, Click the subscribe button na and click the bell beside it para lagi notified kapag mayroon ako bagong uploads. And without further ado, if you want to see how I did this look, then just keep on watching! Hello, hello! Welcome to my bare face that's breaking out. Yes po, nagbe-break out ako actually at this rate. Um, huminahon na siya kasi mostly acne marks na lang. Wala na akong bumps, ganyan. So, ayun nga, last week mas, mas grabe as in may mga bumps ako sa skin and everything. Pero it's not really a big deal to me. I mean, there's makeup and there's skincare to make up for it. Feeling ko blessing in disguise din minsan pag nagbe-break out ako. Para at least alam nyo na I still struggle with my skin issues. And doon din talaga ako nakaka-test out ng products kung effective ba sila. So actually, I'll be testing out like mga affordable skincare naman um, sa later part of this year para at least meron tayong options kung hindi afford yung iba kong mga skincare na ginagamit dun tayo sa affordable. I have already moisturized my skin and yung ginamit ko is of course my Caris M Plus Cream. Um, it's just very hydrating and I feel so dry nowadays. So foundation na tayo yung gagamitin ko is yung L'Oreal Infallible Fresh Wear. One of the best foundations I've tried and I'm just gonna pump not a lot kasi ayoko magmukhang super cakey yung skin ko eh. Light layer lang. Usually, I use my Inga foundation. Kung hindi nyo siya afford or kung nahirapan kayong hanapin siya. Although, hindi naman siya mahirap hanapin. Pero, um, ayun. Ito na lang. Si L'Oreal Infallible Fresh Wear. Maganda rin. Pag mga events talaga, guys, I really would suggest na hindi ganun kakapal yung foundation nyo. And just spot conceal wherever you need to kasi the more products you apply on your skin, naturally, the more it's gonna cake. Try to not really, like, put too much um, foundation. Especially if it's an event where you have to meet people like up close this is one thin layer of the foundation as you can see i still have like spots to cover up so under eyes naman i'm gonna be using maybelline fit me concealer this is in the shade 15 fair um for my under eyes since hindi naman ganun ka rame yung eye bags ko i really like a lightweight concealer and then i'm also gonna put a little bit on my lid since we are gonna apply eyeshadow today For my spots and blemishes, I'm gonna be using my L'Oreal um, Infallible Full Wear Concealer. So I'm just really trying to focus the coverage on the areas that I feel like I could use a little bit more help, but then I don't want it to look, you know, fake and just too much. And then use a brush like this to make sure the concealer is well blended on the skin. Tapos maximum yung coverage na makukuha. Because Beauty 2019 was a success thanks to you guys. Sa mga pumunta, sa mga na-hug ko, sa mga naka, you know, chika ko, naka, um, kuha ng loot bag sa mga gold na members ko na pumunta sa event. Sobrang thank you guys. As in, na-enjoy ko yung two days, nabitin pa nga ako, and nasepang talaga ako. Pag uwi ko, hagulgol ako. Kasi diba nga, I had a pretty rough last month or last last month bayon it was pretty rough for me but then having you guys and just realize ko how overflowing and overwhelming your love and support was not just for me but for all of us nakaka overwhelm and i 
I'm realizing it more now how blessed I am. And that is why I'm more motivated to do videos. Eh. Sobrang, I don't know. I don't even care about the views anymore. Parang, you know what? Whatever. Okay lang. As long as I love what I'm doing, you know, it's fine. As long as I enjoy this, that's all that matters. And yeah, that's why I'm doing these, you know, because I really miss the old times or just sit down, do a makeup tutorial, and give you tips and tricks, share makeup favorites. I don't know, and just have a fun time. So, sa pagkilay, gusto ko talaga yung kilay ko nakatayo. So, I'm gonna be using the Vice Cosmetics Gandal Volumizing Brow Gel. My color is natural brown. May little pieces of fiber siya na nakaka-give ng fullness din sa kilay. And it does help me, ano ba, minimize my brow routine and, you know, make it fast. So, I flick my brows up. Dami ka tanong sa inyo nito eh, kung ano yung ginawa ko. Just, you know... Flick your brows up. Actually, dapat gagamit kayo ng sabon, yung soap brows technique. Pero, yung sabon ko kasi sis ando na at tinatamad ako. So, yun na lang. Pero, kung gusto mo talaga ng extra hold soap brows, ma-recommend ko siya. Nagtatanong-tanong ako sa mga tao kung ano yung mas favorite look nila. Yung day one ko or yung day two ko sa Because Beauty. And majority of you guys told me na mas gusto niyo yung, yung makeup ko lang. Salamat naman guys. Na-appreciate niyo siya. Basta the key is pataasin niyo lang yung kilay niyo. Okay? Para nakatayo siyang ganun. Guys, naglagay ako ng hairspray kasi hindi kinakaya nung vice yung look na gusto ko. So, maglagay kayo ng hairspray kung wala kayong super, yung soap brows or sabon lang. Pwede na or hairspray. And then I'm just flicking it up. Ayan. So, ayan yung effect niya. Parang, di ba? Sobrang editorial. I'm gonna use Maybelline Fit Me Press Powder. And I'm gonna set my eyelids with this para pwede tayo mag-eyeshadow. Siyempre, smooth out mo muna yung eyelids mo bago mo siya iset. Make sure walang creasing from the concealer. And then, set lightly. So, eyes na tayo. Gagamitin ko yung EB Ulti Matte Eyeshadow Palette. Yung tones nito, um, halos yun yung tones na ginamit ko rin sa makeup look. Diba? So, I'm just putting... Sorry. What am I doing? I'm putting on this shade. Di ko kasi alam mula siyang name. Parang as like an all-over wash. It's parang pinky siya. Putting that as an all-over crease color on my eyes. So, blend, blend, blend. Tapos, i-blend mo rin dito. So, wag ka lang dito mag-blend. Huwag lang ganito. Pag ganito rin. Para may parang pahila effect. Ganun. Ayun o. Oh. Kita mo ba? Parang I'm dragging it a little further. Ayan. I'm gonna go into the Caroline Play to Slay palette. I'm gonna choose this peach. And I'm just gonna kinda do the same thing. Kasi medyo nakulangan ako dun sa shade na yun. I know right now it looks crazy, but trust me, later it's gonna come together. So, we're back to the ultimate, and I'm going to use this mauve shade. It's powdery because the shades of EB are powdery. It's kind of powdery the eyeshadows. But when you look at the pigmentation, it's not too cooling. So for me, I don't hate them. It's okay, sis. That's it. So, mas dark yung color dito sa matang to. Okay? I'm just gonna blend everything together. So weird. Kukunin ko tong dalawang shades na to. And ito yung parang ibablend natin sa ating brow bone. Para siyempre may dimension ang ating mata. Yan, just to like really blend everything out. So, nagawa ko na yung upper part ng mata ko. Ngayon naman, pupunta tayo sa blush. Kasi cream blush yung gagamitin ko. I'm gonna be using Sunny's Face 143 Lipstick as my blush. And then I'm just gonna stipple using a small stipple brush. This is e.l.f. I'm just gonna like really try to you know have it look blended out. Siguro na kagulat kayo ngayon pero promise ato talaga yung ginawa ko. Going back to the Maybelline Fit Me Powder, I'm gonna set my under eyes. 
Pwede ko na iset yung under eyes ko kasi nalatag ko na yung cream blush ko. Kukuha ako ng brush na ganito na flat, yung parang, ano ba tawag dito? Lower line brush or liner brush. And then I'm gonna be dipping back into the Ultimate palette. And I'm gonna be getting this color, yung plummy. Yung patchy color. Pero okay lang. Lower lash line lang. And then, I'll bring up ko lang para pantay siya. So, for my favorite part, which is glitter. Ayan, mag-a-apply ka ng glitter, guys. Ito yung nakita kong affordable, pero easily accessible. And super ganda. So, ito yung peri-pera na yung mga glitter, yung mga parang glitter eyeshadow nila. So, gagamit tayo number 3 and number 4. Si number 3 na lang muna dito sa ating kabuoan ng mata. Sis, kakaiba siya. And then, kinakalat ko lang siya gamit yung kamay ko. Hindi saktong-sakto yung kulay nito dun sa kulay na ginamit ko sa um, sa event. Kasi medyo medyo pagka-gold yun. Pero, close enough. Hindi na rin halata pag nasuot nyo na. Sige lang, maglagay lang kayo kung feeling yung kulang go Gosis. Tapos, ilalagay ko rin siya sa inner corner ko. Tapos, ilipat ako sa number 4 na shade. Yung medyo silver. Tapos, tatapalan ko yung rose gold. Para kinang na kinang talaga siya. Gusto mo yung maging center ng attention is the eyes because, I don't know, I think it just looks so pretty. So after ko mag glitter, I'm gonna be putting this nude eyeliner. This is from Rimmel. Unfortunately, wala akong mahanap na ganitong eyeliner sa iba. So, ito na lang muna. It just gives the illusion of bigger eyes and it just opens up the eyes. So the eyes are almost done. Ngayon, I'm gonna be taking this dark shade. And then I'm gonna be mixing a little bit of setting spray para maging liquid liner ganun siya. But since it's an eyeshadow, mas soft siya. Then I'm gonna line my eyes just the tiniest bit. You don't want to cover your hard work, yung mga glitter liner. Yung glitter eyeshadow, yung eyeshadow. You don't want to cover all of those. But you just want to add definition. So I'm just doing that. By adding a thin layer of this eyeshadow onto my eyes. Just to kind of give it, you know, a little bit of definition. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to wing it. Very lightly. And then swipe up like this. Swipe up! Yeah, swipe up lang. And then, you know, wing mo lang ng konti. Very lightly lang. Make sure it's like a wing. So when you do that little wing, it kind of gives the illusion that it lifts your eyes a little bit. I'm not sure if you can see, pero parang gumanan siya. And then I'm just gonna connect it here. Ayan. Hmm. So the eyes are almost complete. Mascara na lang yung kulang. So now I'm gonna be going back to my face. I'm gonna take my Nichido, um setting powder and I'm gonna be setting all over my face. Let's also wipe off the fallout. Yung mga glitter fallout. Kanang ganern. May mga ilan Wipe out mo na lang yan. So I'm gonna curl my eyelashes. Wait lang. So mascara, I'm gonna be using L'Oreal Lash Paradise. Ito rin yung mascara na ginamit ko dun sa event. And di siya humulas, hindi niya ako iniwan. It's so black and it actually gave me really, really nice volume. So, super love. Itong look na to, wala siyang false lashes. But if you wanna go ahead and add lashes, do so to your liking. Pero ako gusto ko nga, yung parang wearable everyday makeup look ko lang. Fresh, fresh lang.
sorry, last step sa mata pala. I'm also gonna be applying some glitter underneath my eyes. Glitter. Gagamitin ko tong EB Advanced Face Trio. I'm gonna use the bronzer shade in here. Ito pala yung Baked Fig. So, yeah, just bronzing the skin. Blendable naman siya. So, kahit na mapadami ka sa una, it does blend pretty nicely, pretty decently onto the skin. Just to gonna give you, you know, warmth. Eh, maputi ako. So, kailangan ko talaga ng something. Okay, contour time. L'Oreal Brow Artist Genius Kit, of course. Ayan, o. Oh. Kita nyo ba yan? Malapit ko na siyang mahit pansis. Sa ilong. Alam niyo na kung paano ko siya ginagawa. Ganyan lang. Tapos ibablend ko sa aking kilay. Para hindi halata. ba Bring it up. Like so. Yun talaga sis. Alam kong may blush sa tayo. And yung blush actually nagko-complementa dun sa mata. But I want something more. Like gusto ko potok na potok siya. Kasi kitang kita sa photos. And it looks so nice. And even in person nakaka-fresh siya. So I'm gonna use the Chris Everblend na Chris Lasting Love na blush. Sobrang. Siguro ito yung isa sa mga favorite blushes ko ngayon. Kasi ang ganda ng undertone niya. It's a berry tone. Hindi siya yung peach. Pero mas more on berry siya. And hindi peach itong look na to eh. Berry. ba Berry berry. So... Oh my gosh, talagang on top of that, yung lipstick na nilagay natin kanina, yung Sunny Space, maganda siya. As in, parang nagko-compliment siya. So, after blush, maglalagay na ako ng faux freckles. Yung ginamit ko kasi is yung K-Palette na One Day Tattoo Lasting Brow Tint Pen. Ayan siya, guys. Wala akong nakitang dupe nito, eh. So, try ko na lang mag-link ng medyo affordable options. I already have some freckles and a couple of little textures. So, imbes na maging pimple yan, gawin natin freckles yung mga yan. Ang ganda to sa pictures ka mo. So, kahit na medyo darkan mo siya, okay lang. Kasi... Sa pictures talaga, as in, super okay. So, now naman sa highlighter, guys. Ito yung gagamitin ko, Blythe, na Stardust Palette. Maganda kasi yung ditong shade niya. Reminds me of my Wet n Wild highlighter. But, of course, yung Wet n Wild, mas maganda pa rin, syempre. But, this is quite nice. So, I'm gonna, you know, just mix and match a couple of highlight colors. I'm gonna highlight. Okay. Para lang may something tayo, kahit pa paano. Like a base. Okay, so after I have put that highlighter on, so the star of the show that I used dun sa makeup look na talagang mm, sobrang glowy is the Fenty Diamond, um, uh, what do you call it? Diamond Veil Highlighter, yung How Many Carats. So pag inopen mo siyang ganito, ito yung itchwear ng highlighter. Sobrang love na love ko to, especially pag may events ako. Kasi I can use it both on my eyes, on like my cheeks, my face, and even on my body. So I super love it. But I know it's expensive. Um, pero ito talaga yung ginamit ko. So maghahalap nga ako ng dupe for it. Um, kung meron ako nahanap, babalitaan ko kayo. So bali ginagawa ko, tuktok lang ng sponge, and then I dust this basically like everywhere. And it's just gonna give a wet, like it gives a wet effect. I swear, you guys. Sobrang, what? Sobrang nakaganda siya. Tapos dito rin, sa ilong. Parang meron siyang effect talaga na binibigay na parang, oh my gosh. Sobrang natural and, I don't know, glittery and nice. No effect niya sa skin. It just looks so pretty and just so like dewy and glossy. Kulang na lang natin is yung sa lips natin. So lip liner muna. Yung kagamitin ko is the BTLA lip liner in the color Regina. Super love this one. As in, um, affordable version sa nung Pixi ko. Pero mas ano to? Mas I guess mauvey. Yung sa Pixi kasi mas brown. As in naka contour siya. Pero tada naman kung naghanap ka yung affordable contour na lip liner. Maganda siya. Overdrawing my lips, of course. For the lips, Pen Shop in Legally Nude. Ito yung kanilang Hydra Matte Lipstick. 
So, lagay ko lang siya dito. For the inner portion, I'm gonna be using the Sunny's Face Lip Dip in Boysenberry mixed with cocoa. So, si Boysenberry kasi masyado siyang purple. And ayoko naman ng purple hair hull. Yan. So the last step for this look is of course to set everything. I'm using my favorite Pixie Rose Glow Mist just to give it a little bit of a glow and para lang malock everything in. Ta-da! So this is the finished look. Sana naman nakopya ko yung mga pinapost ko na day to look ko sa Because Beauty. Ayan siya guys. Super dewy. Super pretty and glittery and just um, very flattering. I feel like everyone can really rock this look. Yes, that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. I had so much fun filming it. And medyo matagal siyang i-film, sissy. Pero worth it naman kasi ayoko nang tanggalin tong makeup ko ngayon. I swear, I love it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't. Comment down below what you want to see next on my channel. And I'll be seeing you guys on my next one. Bye!